In SolidWorks, to design anything, we always start with a sketch. So I'll come up and select my sketch menu, and I'm going to start with a rectangle. I'm going to hit my rectangular pull down menu, and I can see the different kinds of rectangles that are out there. Let's start with center rectangle. Now, I'm going to come out and select my top plane upon which to draw. And I'll start off at the origin point here, and I'll just kind of pull out like this. And there I'll have my rectangle I'm going to be designing from. So I come up here to dimensions, smart dimensions, and I'm going to select 2.5 off this right here. And it says it's set at 2.6 uh, on this. I'll say 2.5 inches. Now I'm designing this from a piece of wood that I can buy at any home improvement store like Lowe's or Home or uh, Lowe's or Home Depot. Now this wood that I'll be using is called poplar. It's very inexpensive, but it's a good hard wood to work with for this project. The length of this wood for this project and for this nameplate is going to be 9 inches. So I'm going to go ahead and hit 9 inches and keep that. And then now I'm going to select that dimension and approve it. And then I'll come up to features and I'm going to do extrude boss base. The wood I'm going to be buying from the home improvement store is a quarter of an inch thick. And as you can see, I've already put in a quarter of an inch in decimal. Or I can go 1 slash 4 inches and that will give me the equivalent measurement of a quarter of an inch. And I'll check that off and there it is. Now the part is already set to wood as a material type but we'll come back to this in a moment.